It's interesting, bullying has changed. I will tell you, when I was a student here, bullying was very overt. There was the pushing in the hallways, there was the verbal altercations, you know, it was observable behavior. Today, most of the bullying activities actually occur off of our campuses. It's the cyberbullying, it's the, it's the digital age where kids are picking on each other and excluding each other and singling others out. The reality is without CVIC spearheading the process, we never would have been eligible for the funds and have so many wonderful programs in place. My name is Jody Thompson, Assistant Superintendent for the Grand Forks Public Schools. CVIC is a comprehensive violence intervention and prevention center. So we really come at the problem of violence from all angles, everything from when there's a crisis situation and we're there to help support and, and help somebody through the trauma, all the way through to helping them heal from long term from what's happened. And then in the last few years, we've really focused on the prevention of violence as well. We want to teach kids from an early age that about healthy relationships and respect and what the research is showing is that if kids can develop healthy friendships at the elementary level or even before that, they're much more likely to go on and have healthy dating relationships and healthy intimate partner relationships. I'm Christy hall Duran. I'm the Executive Director at the Community Violence Intervention Center in Grand Forks. I think one of the things that makes us unique here in Grand Forks um, is the level of collaboration that we have in this community. Um, we don't think that the problem of violence is something that CVAC um, could or should tackle on our own. Strong, healthy children are the future of your community, and that is what we, that is what we in public service strive for. And it's just wonderful to see that we have so many people who share the same goal. We want healthy, happy children who can self-actualize and succeed. My name is Michael Brown. Uh, we're from Grand Forks, North Dakota, and I'm the mayor of Grand Forks, and I'm an OBGYN doctor at All True Health System. It's awful. You start feeling like everyone's against you, and it's just you don't want to go to school. And I loved school. It was my favorite thing. And it's tough to be strong, and sometimes you have to admit you can't handle a situation on your own. And as tough as that is, it's, it's worth it to come in and get help. And sometimes that's the stronger thing to do. After my counseling session with them, it was just, I felt really good inside and they called my school and we talked to, you know, the principals and the officer, our resource officer, and they addressed the situation and it got so much better right away. My name is Claudia. I'm a high school student. I go to Grand Forks Central High School. We take really seriously the fact that we're here to educate students and to teach them obviously as much as we can, but we're really also aware of the fact that we're trying to help them become young men and women um, and grow in their character. Our kids are making a difference. They're making a difference in really small ways and we talk about that. Um, just walking down the hall and saying hi to somebody might be a very small gesture that makes a really big impact. I am Katherine Galach, I'm the principal of Schrader Middle School. We can spend all kinds of time talking about what not to do and stop there. But our efforts and the efforts that we have collaboratively, I think in the same vision as CVIC, is to shift that into taking action. When people say that everyone gets bullied, well, we can change that. Not everyone has to be bullied. It doesn't have to be part of our lives anymore.